Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. The following contest is an Iron Man match. Making his way to the ring from Punjab, India, weighing in at 347 pounds, the great Carey. Matches like these with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in art form. The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. And his opponent from Hiroshima, Japan, weighing in at 165 pounds. If you listen to After the Bell this week, you know this is a match I've wanted to see for quite some time, and it's almost time to start. No, get up! That's right! Don't get up! Hey! Let's go! This is a guy who always seeks out the highest level of competition, and I think he'll get it tonight. If you're trailing in an Iron Man match, you have to find a turning point to even things up. Don't you agree, Corey? I do, and that means you have to have enough to keep your foot on the gas pedal to keep the match going. It is crucial to be able to create your own opportunities while minimizing risk when at a deficit in an Ironman match. And you don't want to have to come back from a multiple fall deficit to a death sentence in a match like this. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? A oh, knee smash in the face. Firm control. What a boot. Able to elude it. Setting him up for the slap line. Man, face first. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Rapid fire rights over and over. Guys, they are getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. And this kind of match, is it better to get out to an early lead or keep things even for as long as you can? There's certainly arguments for both, but if you find yourself in a position where you can run up the score, from where I'm sitting, you should by all means take it. And now thrown back into the ring. Oh, blackjack! Come For the pin and the win! Yes! He gets the kick out after the one. Not quite enough to put him away. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh my gosh, terminating knee smash. Look at this, he just tossed the leg. Not oh, target of the arm. Ooh. Fight in them, not going to let it end like this. Ow, bam. Ooh, ouch! He deflects it right back. He heads outside. Countouts legal in this match. Whoa. Double underhook applied. Butterfly suplex. Absorbing 
some tough hits now. You put in the work, now it's time to capitalize and get a point. There. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Uh oh. Hard side kick. Right to the ribs. Caught. Uh, Off the rope. Oh. The rope. What a roundhouse kick. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Kicks to the face. Oh, man. good grief. Turn your lights out. Great wherewithal on the counter. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. And he goes into the ring. You can begin to see it in these superstars' faces. Exhaustion is beginning to set in. This time to breathe heavier. This is the time. Uh -huh. Wildly throwing your body out of the ring like that is more often than not going to provide such a result. That was an example of boldness and backfire. Boom, right across the small of the back. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Big boom. He's in a bad way, guys. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Pot right in the stomach creates the separation. Oh, look at the knees. Endless knee strikes. Perched on the shoulders. Beast your eyes. Nobody hits that one better. Go. 
This one is headed outside, guys. One. Beautiful arm ringer applied. Beautiful back kick. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. These will keep you down. Clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Let's go. 
match offense from him. Okay, give it up to him. Still going strong here. Just taking flight. He's taking charge here. If he was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. And gets tossed back into the back. I think we know what's coming next. Wow. 